Pockle and welcome to At The Bar. And today we are at Roy's at Hilton. And I'm here with Brian, who's our restaurant manager, who's going to teach us how to make the... Cosmopolitan. The Cosmopolitan. Yes. Who doesn't love a Cosmopolitan, especially if you grew up watching Sex in the City like me. So let's get started. Get your glass, chill box. Always start off with your distilled alcohol, starch knife. Then let's put the orange flavored liqueur, which is the triple sec. Let's put it. There you go. 15 mils. The key to this drink is actually fresh ingredients. So what you're gonna do is use fresh lime. The cosmopolitan is actually not a red drink. Most people oh, actually... Oh, I, I thought it was pink. Oh, yeah, it's pink. It's yeah. not a red. Because most people actually like, you know, uh, tend to put a lot of cranberry in there. Okay. So here, what we're gonna do is... Because the girls, they like have... their drinks pink. Mm -hmm. Just a blush, just like a rosé. And let's put ice. Okay, shake this for me. I think my chicken right now. <laughs> Look at the beautiful color. It's just rosé. That fragrance we're looking for? Mm -hmm. uh, what I just did is uh, release those beautiful aromas from the orange peel, which are the orange oils. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Yes. And I smothered on the rim and also at the stem. So every time they drink it, of course the ladies. We love things that smell good and that are pretty. So this is it? Yes. This the is cosmopolitan. the cosmopolitan. Oh How do you like it? I like that. Now I can see why the girls in Sex in the City really drink this a lot. So now we've treated our ladies to cosmopolitans. Brian, what's next? Okay, we do have the uh, perfect Rob Roy. This is actually an old English cocktail. Okay, let's start off with the glass again. The first one, we shaked it, right? We shook it, mm -hmm. uh, we shook the cocktail. But in this case, we're gonna be stirring it because okay. we're, we only have the clear alcohol over here. Start with this one. Put an ounce and a half, which is 45 mils. And Perfect Crowberry is actually a combination or incorporated with sweet and dry vermouth. This is similar to the Manhattan. Okay. And But in Manhattan, it's actually bourbon. Okay. So let's start, just dash. Just dash up this one. And then after that, let's put the ice. This time I want you to stir. <laughs> I want you to stir you this 19 times, okay? Why first can't things be? first, you wanna hold the bar spoon just like a bartender, like a pro bartender. Okay. Okay, hold in between. Find the perfect balance. Okay. Just place this glass over here. What you wanna do, do the motion of in and out. Okay, just like that. Oh, it's just... Do, do not stir like you're at home. Okay, not like I'm at home. That's right, that feels weird, weird already. Why? 19 times. Why 19? Four? <laughs> That's having waste style, right there. You don't have to double strain this one because you only stir it. Every time you shake, you bruise the ice. Okay. But in this case, you only actually diluted the ice. Okay. And get the water from it. Okay. Very good explanation. The garnish for that is actually a maraschino. Maraschino cherry, just on top. And last but not least, Brian, what are we making? Okay, the last one, uh, the first one we did the Cosmopolitan, which is for, for you. For, for the, the ladies. ladies. Yes, of course. And for our gentlemen, we did uh -huh. the perfect. Perfect Rob Roy, perfect which Rob is Roy. actually invented in Waldorf. Uh, I'm just gonna add this one. Waldorf back in the 1890s. Yes. Very, very cool. Uh, but very in this case, drink. we're going to be uh, making the GBC. GBC stands for the gin. In gin. this case, we're going to be using the Tanqueray. Okay. Of course, a very smooth Tanqueray over here. Basil and cucumber. Let's start with the gin, as always. And an ounce and a half, 45 mils. We're going to be putting the uh, fresh cucumber over here. And then we do have some basil over here that I just picked up earlier. And what you want to do is model it. Of course, ice here. And then secret ingredient is fresh lime. Always, always go fresh. We're gonna go ahead and have Brian shake it because I hear he has superb shaking skills that uh -huh. I don't have. You can go ahead. I'll try, I'll try. <laughs> okay, uh, you wanna shake it for 10 seconds only. You, okay. you don't wanna bruise that, uh, those eyes. Okay. Yeah. That's actually I've good. never seen a shaker like that. That's pretty impressive. That's good. Let's put ice in this one. 
And this is the part that takes skill because you're trying to keep the ice from coming in, mm -hmm. right? You're trying to strain it. Okay. Very, very pretty drink already. And you can smell all the fresh ingredients. Just a little bit of club soda. And then as for the garnish, fresh basil. And there you have it, the GBC. The GBC. And again, you can only find this here at Rice? Yes, here at Rice. Because this is his invention. Well, thank you, Brian, for having us. Thank you, Royce, for having us. And thank you're you so at the much. bar. Thanks so much. Mm -hmm.